It's a quiet day in Toyland, and Mr. Plod is going about his duties. Hello, Mr. Plod. Why all the hustle and bustle? Is there a crime happening? No, Noddy. Everything's under control. Just finishing up my police work for the day. Putting up wanted posters to catch dangerous criminals? Mm, no, they're just public service posters, Noddy. And I must put them up before I can go to the Skittles house for tea. What do the posters say? It reminds people to keep your neighbourhood tidy and safe. I designed it myself. I think it's important to take pride in your surroundings. Oh, I agree. I like Toy Town because it's so clean and safe. Well, mustn't chat. Unofficial police business, you know. Hmm. <gasps> Wait, Mr. Plod, I have an idea. Let me finish putting up the posters. I can get around town fast in my taxi. Then you'll be able to go to tea. Hmm. That's not a bad idea. Then can I do it? All right, Noddy. But you'll have to put up all these posters properly. After all, this is official police business. Cross my heart and everything else. I triple dipple promise to do my police duties faithfully. Very well. Carry on, Noddy. And thank you. I'll check your work tomorrow morning. Yes, sir. Can I wear your hat, Mr. Plod? What? Wear my official hat? Impossible! What makes you think you qualify to wear a policeman's official uniform? Because I'm doing policeman's duties. Noddy, there's a big difference between helping a policeman and being a policeman. But being a policeman seems so exciting. They always look smart and important in their uniforms. Yes, it's a great honour to wear the blue. But it's for policemen only, not little boys. Couldn't I wear a badge or something? Mm. Oh, well, what's the harm? It's only for a short time. There you go, young Noddy. A shiny policeman's badge. And whistle. <sighs> All right, and my whistle. Now be a good boy and carry out your duties. Goodbye, Noddy. Constable Noddy, you mean? See here, Noddy. Now, just because I let you wear my badge and carry my whistle does not mean you are a policeman. Now remember, Noddy, when you wear this badge, you must act as an example for people and show them how to behave. Now, Scoot. I'm very, very busy, as everyone can tell. Cause any job worth doing is a job worth doing well. Cause any job worth doing is a job worth doing well. Hmm? Hmm. Dino doll. <gasps> She's littering. Stop! In the name of the law! What's wrong, Nardi? As temporary junior deputy assistant in charge of town safety and tidiness, I hereby accuse you of littering. Littering? No, Nardi. That's not what I was doing. Did you leave that rubbish on the ground or not? Well, yes, but I was going well, to... Well, that's littering. And this poster means keep your neighbourhood tidy and safe. And rubbish isn't tidy. I must give you a ticket for littering. A ticket? Noddy, only police officers can give out tickets. Besides, Well, I'm... I work for the police department now. So, Dinah Doll must report to Mr Plod for the crime of littering. Here. Just let me explain, Noddy. Official business awaits. Must keep the streets tidy and safe. And I'll need this for evidence. <laughs> Out of my way, citizens. I'm on official business. 
I wonder what Martha Monkey is doing at Mr. Wobbly Man's house. <gasps> Stop! Halt! Cease! What is it, Noddy? Is someone running away? I'm talking to you, Martha Monkey. You know better than to take something that doesn't belong to you. Everyone knows that. Well, Mr. Wobbly Man wouldn't be pleased to find out that you were taking his milk bottle. Listen, you. I wasn't. I'll ask you to show a little more respect for this badge, thank you. Why are you suddenly acting like a policeman? Because I am one. Almost. What? See, it's my job to keep the neighbourhood tidy and safe. And stopping thieves is how I make things safe. But I'm no thief. I was just... Milk takers shouldn't argue with the law. Now you show this ticket to Mr Plod and he'll know what punishment to give you. If you think I'm going to let a little boy give me a... And I'll take that as <gasps> evidence. Mr Plod will be proud of my police work today. Noddy, <gasps> I need a word with you. Wait until you hear about my day, Mr Plod. I heard about your day, Noddy, and I want my badge and whistle back immediately. What's wrong, Mr Plod? Your face doesn't look happy. I'm not happy, Noddy. You didn't do your job today. But I did, I did, I did. That is enough I did, Noddy. My job was to protect Toy Town from litter bugs and thieves. No, your job was to put up posters and that's all. But you told me to show people how to behave. Yes, by behaving well yourself, not by giving out tickets. But look, I caught Dinah Doll littering. No, she wasn't. She was taking that bag of rubbish to throw out. And along the way, she stopped to pick up somebody else's rubbish. Oh... Then what about Martha Monkey stealing Mr Wobbly Man's milk? Martha was doing him a favour. She's taking care of his house while he's gone. She took the milk off his porch so it wouldn't spoil in the sun. Oh. Why didn't she say so? Because you didn't give her a chance. I'm a terrible temporary junior deputy assistant of... You know. Plus, I made my friends feel bad. No, oh, cheer up, Noddy. You meant well. And you did get all the posters put up like I asked. Tell you what, I have one last job for you before you're done being a policeman. Really? Can't believe it. I can't... Oh, no. Here comes Officer Noddy again. He probably wants to give us another ticket for breathing in public. Be calm, Martha. Let's see what he has to say. Hello, Dinah. Hello, Martha. I have something for you. I knew it. Another ticket. I'm going to rip this up too! No, no, wait. It's for Mr Plod. Read it. This is a good citizen ticket. Thank you for keeping our town tidy. And thank you for being helpful by taking care of a friend's house. I like this kind of ticket. I'm sorry for not listening to you both earlier. I may have put up the posters, but you two did what the posters said. You made the town tidy and safe. Well, that's the kind of police work I like to see, Noddy. No, thank you. I'm finished being a policeman. But you delivered these tickets so nicely. You're a great temporary junior, uh, whatever it was. Yes, I'd say Mr Plod found a very good helper after all. 